A bill similar to Florida's so-called Don't Say Gay Law has been unveiled at the Utah Legislature. Yeah, Daniel Woodruff live at the Capitol with the story tonight. Daniel? Mark and Heidi, LGBTQ advocates are blasting the bill tonight. The lawmaker who's pushing it says he did not intend to pattern it after Florida's law. Republican Representative Jeff Stainquist of Draper told me he had a woman in his district who co contacted him saying that she was concerned about conversations taking place at her child's school. So he asked analysts to come up with a bill to address it. Well, what they came up with is very similar in language to a law that was passed in Florida last year that critics have called Don't Say Gay. That law prompted sharp criticism from celebrities, Disney, and the White House. I asked Stenquist today if he worried that Utah would be opened up to that backlash if his bill moved forward. I did think that there were going to be some questions about that, but when I looked at the language, it just seemed so common sense to me that we just simply make sure that we're having age-appropriate discussions about sexuality with our with, in, in the classroom. That, to me, seems just uh, really straightforward. But LGBTQ rights group Equality Utah is criticizing the bill, telling me, quote, Equality Utah is very dismayed to see a don't say gay bill introduced in Utah, especially when the Utah legislature enacted legislation repealing similar language from Utah code in 2017. This bill is damaging and stigmatizing to LGBTQ children and their families, and we will oppose it vigorously. Now, I should note, we have just over a week left in the legislative session, so at this point, it's not even clear that this bill will get a hearing, but Stenquist told me he believes this is an important discussion to have, and if it doesn't go through this year, he intends to work on it over the summer and maybe bring it back next session. Live at the Capitol, Daniel Woodruff, KUTV 2 News.